Hey folks, welcome to Puzzle Spoilers. Today we're taking a look at the Roy Rogers Trick Knife. This is a vintage piece. I believe this came out in the 1960s. Seems to be marketed for kids. Roy Rogers was a famous Western actor and singer. Puzzle knives are their own class of mechanical puzzles. There's not too many examples of puzzle knives, but this is one example. The goal of this puzzle is to open the knife, and it is a functional knife. Usually on small pocket knives like this, there's a small notch in the blade where you can put your thumbnail and pull the blade out. On this knife, there is no notch, and we are not quite sure how to open it. Let me show you how to solve it. The trick here is very simple, and you might figure it out by accident. So it's not much of a puzzle, but it does take one step. We need to orient the knife correctly, and once it's in the right orientation, it will open up. And the correct orientation happens to be like this, and gravity's doing some work here, so make sure to grab it just like this with the blade on the right side and the point on the up position there. And then we just need to push in with a little bit of pressure on the blade, and the blade comes out, and we can open up the knife here carefully. And there we go, the puzzle is solved. We can see here on the blade, it says Imperial Ireland Imperial, was a knife manufacturer. They made knives in the US and Ireland. It's a little difficult to see, but you can see how the mechanism works. There's a small pin in there. When the knife is in the locked position, that pin locks in with that hook there, and that effectively locks up the blade. Then when we turn the knife over, the pin falls down a little bit and is able to clear that hook and open up normally. To reassemble the puzzle, we can close the blade. It'll close in any orientation, so that doesn't matter. So we'll carefully close the blade. Now we can't lock it up again like this. We do need to turn the puzzle over so that the tip is pointing downwards. And at this point, we can push in. It'll catch on to that gravity pin and lock in again. This is a vintage puzzle. You'll have to find it at auction. I'll put the names of some of my favorite auction sites below. If you found the video interesting, please consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. That's it for today, folks. I'll see you in the next video.